levels of state. Finish question. Но там уже решит 100 тысяч азербайджанцев. Вы согласны, что эти люди должны жить в своих землях? Но они там жили. Они да, как будет игра просто создание доверия мира. I think uh, the territorial integrity of all states should be respected, including the territorial integrity of the mountainous Karabakh Republic. Uh, uh, they, they're old and new states. Uh, Azerbaijan is a new state. Uh, and I think that uh, in the post-Soviet space, it is still under question what is the extent of the territorial integrity of the states uh, in, in the region. I think this is subject to a peace process, but it is very clear to me that whether Old or new, recognized or not, the the, uh, the Republic of Mountainous Karabakh uh, has a right of recognition. Azerbaijan would be would do very well to be the first to recognize. I, I understand that's a difficult issue, but uh, on the issue of, of refugees, as I said, they're refugees of all nationalities, and all, and all refugees of all nationalities should have the right to return to their ancestral homelands, and that refers to Armenians, to Azerbaijanis, that re uh, uh, re refers to Azerbaijan to the Republic of Mountainous Karabakh, to Armenia, to Turkey. I think there should be a multilateral return, but to, to secure that return, we need a new environment that is based on good faith, on, on confidence building, and not releasing convicted axe murderers, and not ruining cemeteries, and not, especially at the presidential level, uh, talking about uh, neighboring countries in a derogatory way. That won't help anything. Uh, we can all, each of us, live in our own little realities, issue press releases and position papers. But if we want a solution, a solution, then we need a new benchmark for uh, dialogue and communication. That's why I've come here. Uh, I'm thankful uh, for the invitation of ICAP. I'm uh, thankful for uh, uh, for the reception that, that I've received here. It's my first visit uh, to, to Baku. Uh, I hope to visit the, the old Armenian church here. I wish I would be able to meet with, uh, with uh, some Armenians. I'm told there are uh, several thousand Armenians. I would look forward to meeting with them if they're organized in any way. But the bottom line of my, uh, my coming to Baku uh, is to uh, seek the channels and avenues of finding a new way. But if we want to discuss partisan politics and positions, I will respond to your terminology, tete a tete, uh, and we will continue this way. But uh, just as, just as uh, the rights of refugees and IDPs ultimately should be uh, respected, they should have the right to return in, uh, uh, after the security guarantees are in place and after the, the, the major issue, underlying issues have been resolved, uh, you must understand as well, and I'm not forcing you, it's up to you, that, uh, that the people of Mountainous Karabakh uh, who have constitutionally uh, set up their uh, their own way of life, their own identity, and their own republic. Uh, to have a right also uh, to a uh, dis distinguished, a dignified, and a secure uh, existence. We have to overcome the xenophobia. We have to overcome the name calling. We have to overcome this machoism that uh, a lot of us have. And if we do that, we'll go forward. But if if not, we'll stay in this situation for a long, long Thank time. You. Thank you. Thank you.